Hey guys, how you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to the channel. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider to subscribe and help the channel. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. We got this sandbar. This is LG Sandbar. SQC4R Sandbar. This gear deserves your attention. This is 4.1 channel sandbar with wireless subwoofer and two rear speakers. This sandbar is 220 watts audio power with optimized sound. It's very immersive, Dolby audio. Basically, what we want to do is unbox this stuff, check it out, see what is inside. I hope it will help you to make a fun choice. This sandbar you can connect it to your TV via Bluetooth and optical cable. You can also use USB. So use USB drive to play music you have in your USB stick. Okay. So let's check this stuff out and see what is inside. I'm excited. Life is good with LG. This is the sandbar here, very light. This is the subwoofer. This is the link and the rear speakers. Okay, this is the information sandbar top line and TV. Power cables, remote control, another part of the power cable, wall mount, and triple air battery. This is the rear speaker. See what it looks like. Very nice. It's the rear speaker. And this is the second one. second speaker so you can see you got red and black here where you need to put the cables inside this 
This is the cable. Second one. Now this is the the link. See this is the link. And you can see it will show you get R R and L L L. Okay, so so and also this is, is press here for pairing. This in the power cable goes in here for the this link. And this is the subwoofer here. So the power cable is attached to the subwoofer. So this is the wall mount, so we don't need the wall mount. This is the subwoofer here. This, this is the sandbar here. I must say the sandbar is very light, it's not heavy. There we go, this is what it looks like. Nice, it's plastic grill. Very beautiful, I see what it looks like. LG Sandbar SQC4R new best match for LG TV Dolby Audio Bass Blast wireless subwoofer 4.1 channel 220 watts immersive sound Okay, and see the sun, uh, what it looks like. Okay, it's the, this is the two rear speakers and the wire to link it up. This is the subwoofer. Okay, and this is the link. The power cable is for the sandbar. And this one of one of these goes to the sandbar and this one goes to the link the subwoofer the power cable is attached to it and this is what we have here this is the remote control and the triple air battery and the information pack so this basically this is the unboxing and overview of this sandbar this is what is inside it lg sqc 4r Immersive sandbar. This gear deserves your attention. The price here in UK is currently 200 quid. This sandbar is 
five channel high power audio make your living room feel like a cinema with lg sq c4 r samba it got five channel of high power audio and you will hear every detail clearly thanks to the two rear speakers the powerful wireless subwoofer fill your room with bony rattling bars and you hook this up with optical cable usb optical cable is not included in the packaging so i'm afraid if you want to hook it up with optical cable in, then you need to buy the cable separate audio feature auto sound engine dynamic range control so you have the preset mode standard and bass blast bluetooth connection optical and oxy in usb port power 60 watts rear speaker 30 watts subwoofer 100 watts okay so this is what we have here and from the back here from the back you can see optical in and port in and usb and you have dc in here dc in you also have the button here for you to switch this on if you haven't got a remote you can switch this on then use the f to select the function decrease the volume and increase the volume so basically this is what we have here this is the overview of this sound but what i want to do is to show you how to just gonna show you how to set this up first of all we need to the subwoofer got attached power cable okay so first of all we need to plug this on to the power plug it onto the power now take this cable and take this part Okay, push it inside, then this end, plug it on to DC in to the sandbar, now plug it on, to the, plug it onto the socket, now the next thing to do is this one, Take this end. So push this end inside it and plug it on to DC in for the link. Okay. And uh, now the next thing to do is take the cable. So with this cable, you have this end. Okay, so you have gray and blue. So you have gray and blue. So so you can see the cable what it looks like. Okay, so take the gray one so take the gray to go, go to the gray and take the blue one to the blue okay I can see the cable so 
the gray goes to the gray bit and the one blue goes to the blue okay and you take the other end of the cable take this end of other can end of the cable and go to the back of the speakers okay so take this end to the black and take this end to red Okay, and this in. Now the next thing to do is take the next cable. So take the gray one. Yeah. So the bottom one, bottom one, where it's written R, then take the other end to L, to the right one where it's written L. Okay, so basically you can see what it looks like. So, okay. so this cable will be on the top, the other one go to the bottom, just make sure you alternate it. And now I take this part of the cable, go to the back. Okay, so take the black one, goes to the black. Just need to push this, push it down a little bit, okay. Then put it inside and disattach. Then do the same thing to the to the red one. Push it down. Then put the cable inside it. And it's in, okay. Now. The next thing to do is plug it onto the socket. And you can see the light. I'm showing us green light to show you the power is on. And also the subwoofer is also showing us green light here. Okay. And now the next thing we need to do is we need to switch Okay, this is the remote control. So open up the remote control, then take the negative to the negative end and the positive to the positive end of the fit. Uh, Go in. Switch on the sandbar. And you can see this is now paired. This one is steady green light is paired and also you can see this one is steady green light this is to show you that they are now linked together now the next thing to do you need to use the f to select the function is currently in optical so we need to select go to bluetooth so use the function to select the bluetooth and now it's highlighting bluetooth is highlighting okay so we need to use any Bluetooth device you have okay so use any Bluetooth device you have I'm going to do this using my mobile phone okay now go to your 
go to your mobile phone and go to the settings okay then select connections switch bluetooth on and select bluetooth okay then you scroll down and look for this device this is lg device s qc4r is available select on it it's pairing bluetooth pair request pair with lg sq4 select pair and it's connected if you go on top you can see it will show you connected now we're going to play music using epidemic sound epidemic sound is music for content creator so go to google select epidemic sound open it up So once you set everything up and all linked together then you see this green light green green light to show you that it's in then it's sign in to your account i'm going to go to save music select this is the audio Plus.
so with this remote control this is the function here you switch this on and off this button here is bass blast you switch the bass blast on and off okay this is dc are on dc are off or rear level speaker decrease subwoofer level increased or subwoofer level decrease auto power off auto power on so this is the volume so if you So this this is this is bass blast this is bass blast off you switch it on again
brilliant. Thank you very much.